Hello everyone, today I have 5 minutes to show you how to use Superbase with Nuxt 3. I'm Sebastian Chopin, I'm the CEO at Nuxt Labs and co-author of Nuxt, and you can find me on the social network with Atinux. We beat the Superbase module with Baptiste Lepro, who is a lead dev at Nuxt Labs, and same you can find him on the social network with Baptiste Lepro. The Superbase module is only a dependency away to your Next app. It is based on Vue 3 composables. It has authentication support. It uses under the hood the Superbase JS isomorphic client. Obviously, it has TypeScript support. And this is how you can install it into your Next 3 app. The composables are quite simple and it opens a reactive way to connect to Superbase. You can have the authenticated user with use Superbase user and the client with the use Superbase client. Let's code. First of all, you need a Superbase project. I created one for this demo and it has a tasks table with a title, a completed, which is a Boolean and a user ID. Next, what you need to do is to add a GitHub application or auth application that I created with the localhost 3000 and the authorization callback. Now let's go to our next three application that I already started in development. I added the Superbase module and enabled it in the build module. In order to activate it properly, I also added the Superbase URL and Superbase key on the element variables. And now let's see our app.view, which is the root component and we can see we have the index page with a login button. So far, it does nothing. So let's add the login. For this, I'm getting the client from use Superbase client. And on on click, I will do client.out.signin. We do have the completion from TypeScript, which is nice. And let's see what it does. We can see the logout at the top, which show that it actually works. So we can get the user this way. So let's get our user, use Superbase user. And I'm going to use watch effect to see when the user is changing. So when it's connected, I will use the router to push to use router to the task page. Great. So now it works. Let's log in again. And I'm redirected. Great. Next, let's go to the tasks page. And first of all, we want to prevent the guest from accessing this page. I created a Nux middleware that will check if the user is connected. And if not, it will be redirected to the home page. So on this, I can set the middleware by setting define page meta and setting the middleware to out. So let's log out, trying to access the task page, and I'm re redirected to the home page. Now, last to do, let's fetch our task from Superbase. For this, I'm going to use use async data, which allow me to have the hydration and only fetch one on the server side. Async function. And I'm going to do client from tasks. Equal user user.value.id and let's sort it by created at. Let's console.log our data dot value. And what do we have here is actually an object with the error data. So using sync data has a transform where we can say only return the body here. Let's refresh and we can see we have our ID or tasks. Let's rename this and we do have our task now and it works. 
create. You can find the documentation of the module on superbase.nuxjs.org. Thank you very much.